this is definitely giving me we're going somewhere vibes. What's up, you guys? It is your girl, Latricia Simone, and welcome back to my channel. If you have not subscribed, y'all, click the subscribe button, okay? Click the subscribe button, click the like button, and stay tuned for plenty, 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 plenty more wig reviews. These lashes are from my lash collection, my personal lash collection, LS Glams. I will leave the link down below just in case you want to shop. These are in the style Mona T Squared. So, this video is not about that. This video is about this, okay? This video is about this hair. Um, so, if you want to know what it is, the details about it, then just stay tuned. Okay, so I had to go get my notes for this one because I wanted to make sure that I did not leave anything out, okay? Um, and actually, hold on. All right, we back. I wanted to give credit where credit is due because I follow this beautiful queen here on YouTube. And I'm sure if you're familiar with the wig to with, with the wig to with the wig community, you may follow her as well. Um, but she inspired me to get this wig. And so when I saw it on her, I was like, oh yeah, I definitely, definitely gotta try that one. This um the name of this wig here is Katiana and I got her in the dark creamy mocha and this is an ultra unit as well and the queen that I was inspired by her name is wigs to, wigs to waist length and um that is her name on IG and that is her name on YouTube as well I double checked just to make sure so I can plug y'all in Okay, she, um, she, this, like, it was, it was bomb. I, I loved it on her. I loved the picture. And so I was like, yeah, I'm definitely trying that one next. Um, I ordered this wig from wigtypes.com. Okay, which I normally order all my wigs from. Unless I'm in a rush and I want a wig, like, the next day, I'll go to the beauty supply store. But we know they're overpriced in there. You can go on wigtypes.com, get a wig for $25, go to the same get the same wig from the beauty supply store is $60. So we're ordering them online. Okay. It's trying to save that coin. Um, on the back, they have several other colors that you can choose from as you can see here. Um, and then they also have it listed on the front. This is a, um, no plucking required unit. And so as you can see, I did not pluck. Well, as you can see, I probably, will. I did not pluck anything. This is what the hairline is looking like. Hold up. This is what the hairline is looking like. Y'all can see where I cut. So I need to cut this right here. Oh, and I did not want to glue it down, right? So, and I didn't. I did not glue this one down. I didn't. And so that's why I kind of had it like kind of behind my ear, or whatever, like that, because I was taking pictures, girl, and I did not want you to see that lace. But um, I didn't glue it down just yet. I said I was going to wait. But as you can see, yeah, here. I use my wig spray that I normally use to kind of tint my lace on my synthetic wigs. Let me see if I can get the spray. So I use this to tint my wigs. They have different colors. This is just the color that I got. Um, I'm sure that I could probably get another color as well, but that's just the color I got here. This wig reminds me a lot of Kaja, I think her name is. This is where the notes come in at. Um, Kaja. This wig reminds me a lot of Kaja, which I reviewed on my YouTube channel as well. Um, and I told y'all, if you are not familiar with my channel, I'm looking for more um, synthetic texture wigs. Uh, synthetic texture wigs. These are synthetic wigs. I'm looking for more wigs that are more like yakky texture um, because they just have lasted longer. And I've just really been like feeling the whole wave and I am going to actually insert the clip um now to what this wig looked like when I first pulled it out of the box here okay so I wanted to come and show you all this this is going to be a little insert um the difference when I blow dry one side and I leave the other side the way it was so this is how it originally looked when it came out of the pack 
and this is the side that I have blow dried. I have been able to kind of tame it a little more right out of the pack. So this is non-blow dried and this is the blow dried side. And this is what it, don't mind my dog. That is my dog. And this is what it looks like with both sides blow dried. So that is a little wig hack. So yeah, that is what it first looked like when I pulled it out. I did blow dry it. I do the majority of my synthetic units like that that are like the yakky texture because sometimes they are a little bit puffy, um, especially like around the top area here. And it just kind of makes it more like um it flows a little bit better to me and so i just really really liked using that technique um on my synthetic wigs that are like yucky texture so that's what i have been doing this wig is your regular typical wig construction with your combs on the side your comb in the back and your adjustable straps it also has another strap that is in the middle that you can use so instead of latching the straps together this time like i normally do i just used the strap at the back and was good to go okay um i don't let me see if they tell y'all how long this wig is this wig is actually pretty long it's longer than no, they don't. Okay, it is longer than Kaja, actually. So this is how long it is on me. So yeah, I was actually um pretty satisfied. So this is the length of here. It's actually pretty pretty satisfied with the length. I was actually pretty satisfied with the length. What else I got for y'all? I think that's it. I think that is it. I like it. I like it. I will be wearing this wig um, for my um, my family trip that I have coming up. Um, that is that, that's why I didn't glue it down because I'm about to get ready to take it off. I just kind of wanted to come and show y'all. Come and show y'all. And of course, when I glue it down, I'm just gonna yeah, let it lay them down. Lay that down like that. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's actually really good. Yeah. Because at first I thought I was going to have to, at first I thought I was going to have to pluck it, but then when I saw the hairline, I was like, okay, yeah, nah. Nah. But let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. Of course, let me know if y'all have tried this unit or not. Let me know what you thought about it. And let me know also if you have any wig suggestions of wigs that you would like me to review prior to you purchasing them. Um, I love hair. I love wigs. All things wigs. So don't be afraid to speak. Okay? Don't be afraid to speak down below. Okay? That is all I have for you all today. Make sure you like this video. Comment down below if you have any wig suggestions. Make sure you subscribe to my channel to stay tuned for all things wigs in the wig city, baby. And I will see you in my next video. Deuces.